Hello everyone, uh, my name is uh, Martin Harley. I'm uh, in running an election on the 7th of June for the Lifford St. Order electoral area. Uh, I would like to take this opportunity to thank you for electing me over the last three terms in the area. It's been a very um, difficult the last five years with the COVID and it's been difficult for all the people of the county and not alone just our area but the whole country as well. But we have come through it. As a council, during the COVID, there was uh, put in place uh, help for businesses to get them through that, which helped to maintain the jobs for people when the COVID was gone, that there was jobs still available for the people. So it was great to be part of the council doing that. There's a lot of difficulties out there with the MICA that still hasn't been properly sorted. And was as a council, we have a unit in place to, to help the homeowners, but we still, we need more help from national government to put the proper structures in place. Housing in the Stroud electoral area. We have uh, acquired a number of sites now that will be going out for tender to for construction of new homes for the area, which is great that there's a land bank going to be in place over the next number of years, which hasn't been in place. That is something that we as councillors have, have worked with the executive and the council to do that. It was exciting there lately to the opening of the Greenway between Castlefin and Lifford and we went to public consultation for the Greenway from Carrigan's St Johnson on into Lifford as well. So what we would hope to do over the next five years is that continue the Greenway from Castlefin on into into Balabafis in order. And there's public consultations happened on two occasions regarding the Greenway from Balabafis in order to Donegal Town through Barnesmore Gap, which will be an exciting project. We, of course, we have to, to think as well about the, the bypass. We're still waiting on the bypass, but as of going to press today, still there are ongoing works that's going on with the NRDO office in Donegal Town. There was more money granted towards that this year. There's, um, there's still challenges out there with um, Eskairn, but we, we need to work with Eskairn going forward to ensure that there's proper treatment plants and proper water supply for the whole of the county. This probably will include the upgrading of Loch Mourne, which has been talked about over the last 15 years, to make the lake bigger, which would be fantastic. And we need to try and connect all the water supplies throughout the county. We talked about, about housing, but the thing as well is there's great support out there now for doing up old houses. County Donegal has between seven and 8,000 empty homes that are not holiday homes. So with the 50 to 70,000 pound grants out there now, it's an opportunity for people that are trying to get on the property ladder to, to get their own home and with this 50 to 70,000 grant it will be a big start and there's, it's, it's easy accessible through the council so it's, um, it's a great, great opportunity for young people to try and get, to get on the proper ladder going forward. So finally, going back on the issues for June the 7th, when you're going out to vote on June the 7th, I want you to remember myself, Martin Harley, and to give me your number one or your highest preference on that day and I intend to work on the issues that, that I've talked about on housing, on water treatment, on water supply, on the greenways, on the bypass of Balbafest and Order, and the regeneration of the Twin Towns going forward. These are the issues, along with other issues that are out there, I would like to work with. I've worked hard over the last 15 years, and anybody who knows me knows that I'm not afraid of work. So I would love to just to give me the opportunity again to um, work with you over the next five years. Thank you very much.